Hello everyone, how the hell are you? So I just fancied a little chat tonight, I suppose, just to find out a bit about your weekend. Hope it was all good. Obviously it was the last one before Christmas and all that jazz, some last minute shopping. We were all pushing through hordes of people like an episode of The Walking Dead, all searching for that one special toy. Actually, what is this year's big special toy? Furby, Tamagotchi, are those things still cool? I, I don't really know. Now I'm lucky enough, I've got two young boys. My three-year-old likes anything, as he says, choo-choo related. So really that's a train set or a Thomas the Tank Engine, anything really. And my five-year-old, well anything, Batman, The Flash, Captain America, Spider-Man, superhero related. Oh yes, and Mario. So we've asked Santa Claus for his very own Nintendo Wii with Super Mario Brothers, which to be honest I can't wait for. Now it's funny how Mario has stayed through an entire generation. I played Mario as a kid, now my children are playing Mario and you know what, I still love it. It's just one of those games that has never really gotten old. It always has that playability factor and actually before I go, before I get on with this commentary, I finally saw Star Wars tonight, The Force Awakens. My son and I went tonight and, you know, I must say, um, we weren't disappointed. Now, I'm obviously not going to spoil it for anyone that hasn't seen it yet, but all I will say is, can you fucking believe that they killed off? <laughs> Lol. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not that bad. Actually, when my son and I arrived home, my wife asked, you know, how was the film? And my son began explaining in immense detail each character, what had happened, and who each character was. So just to break it down, in his words, Luke Skywalker and Princess Leia are brother and sister. Princess Leia and Han Solo had a son. Darth Vader was Luke Skywalker's father. Uh, Luke Skywalker and Ben were cousins. Chewbacca was an oversized Yorkshire Terrier, and so on. So yes, my wife had that blank look on her face and said, that's one screwed up family. It is, really is. Uh, I think she actually says it sounds like an episode of EastEnders and for all you wondering what the fuck EastEnders is think of a shit London Cockney version of The Simpsons we'll say for instance <laughs> so anyway on with this commentary I think um, that's the longest and possibly worst intro ever to a Black Ops 3 skill based matchmaking commentary <laughs> so anyway Black Ops 3 skill based matchmaking that was a thing um, we all had nightmares about and yeah it never really happened did it at all no it never happened here is a tweet from David van der Haar up on the screen so yeah it didn't happen <laughs> we all got our little panties in a twist over nothing and for all you youtubers out there that rush to upload your black ops 3 is ruined and RIP black ops 3 videos all I will say is enjoy that pie on your face. Now to be honest guys I was going to sit here and talk about the gameplay in the background it's obviously TDM and Hunted I'm using some weapon and I'm using the Sparrow um, well, I just can't be bothered. <laughs> in case you haven't noticed I have been struck down with man's most deadly enemy the man flu and yeah I'm, I'm pretty much drugged up to the eyeballs and cough syrup and honey tea so please have some sympathy for me. I don't know, I may sound a bit husky. <laughs> People may like this. So yeah, I was going to talk, as I say, about the gameplay. And I had a really in-depth analysis of the Sparrow weapon. Outriders Sparrow. Uh, but I suppose I got a bit distracted by real life. So we'll call this a bit of a Sunday night ramble, I suppose. Um, probably won't ever happen again. But as I say, it's quite late. I just fancied a little chat. I suppose that's the Irish for you. We never really know when to shut up. Anyway guys, I suppose thanks for sticking around and as always leave a comment if you want or if not, I don't really mind. I'll probably not reply as usual anyway. So I'm planning on a few commentaries coming up before Christmas. If not, um, wish you a Merry Christmas. <laughs> yeah guys, thanks so much for sticking around. It's been an awesome year. I'm sure I'll make a video beforehand. But yeah, see you all in the next video. As I say, Sunday Night Ramble, I'm a little drugged up. 
लव्या बाय